Back here in the Capitol, scores of Bahamians bid a final farewell to former cabinet minister and parliamentarian Dr. Perry Gomez today. He's been described as a pioneer and national treasure whose interest for the Bahamas and people was beyond measure. Carla Palmer reports. The funeral service for the late Right Honorable Dr. Perry Gomez was a reflection of a life well lived and a person well loved. As people from all walks of life, military, uniformed branches and other organizations gathered at St. Agnes Anglican Church to pay their final respects. Prime Minister the Honorable Philip Davis highlighted Dr. Gomez's many local connections and his global reach. Perry was a man for all seasons. As a physician, medical scientist, public administrator, legislator, and cabinet minister. His life epitomized the very spirit of selflessness, commitment, and dedication to improving the health and well-being of the Bahamian people, and by extension, humanity. More pointedly, Dr. Gomez was a pioneer of his time and in his field of medicine. He is world-renowned for his work with HIV and AIDS, serving frontline as an advocate for almost 20 years. Perry Gomez was a nation builder beyond compare. He did not take the easy choice and pursue the path of lucrative private practice. Instead, he made public health his priority and passionately implemented his deeply held principle that health care is a human right, not a privilege. However, few knew the man without the stethoscope. His only daughter, Camille Gomez Jones, remarked, as she attested to her father's dedication as a family man. My father faithfully served his God and his family. He was a staunch Anglican, and he especially loved to sing. My father and my aunts and uncles maintained a very close relationship, and my father instilled in my brother and me the importance of family values. The late Gomez was eulogized by his brother, the most reverend Drexel Gomez, Archbishop retired of the Bahamas and the Turks and Caicos Islands, who says his acts of selfless service was instilled by their parents. Although Perry had no claim to sainthood, his outstanding achievements in the medical arena were all in the service of the principle enunciated by St. Paul. Perry consistently demonstrated a self-giving, sacrificial commitment to the forums of healing and human wellness, not for the sake of personal aggrandizement, but to serve others. Interred in St. Agnes Cemetery on Nassau Street, Dr. Perry Gomez was 76 years old. Hello everyone, I'm Fern Carey. Thank you for watching our YouTube page. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for all things said and asked.